Hey guys and welcome to my new video. In this episode of Tech Hack, I wanted to show you how you can easily edit STL files. Don't understand me wrong, you can edit them with Mesh Mixer or the, or the Sculpt tool in Fusion 360, but it's not possible to extrude something away or add something. It was possible in an older version of Fusion, but since an auto update, it's not possible anymore. You could turn off the design history and try all sorts of things, but I ask lots of people and finally John, thanks John, from the CID chat in Make Amino, get me this little answer. You can do it, but not right in Fusion. So let's jump right into it. So first, you need to make sure that your STL file is completely closed and I also reduced the triangles in Mesh Mixer because uh, my PC is crappy but if you have a better PC that should work perfectly. By the way, if you want a Mesh Mixer tutorial, make sure to leave a like. So I imported it in Autodesk 123D, it's really easy. Just click on it and that opens up this little bar and then you convert mesh to solid or hit M on your keyboard. And that's it, you have a solid object. Now you can edit it directly in 123D or you can export it as a set file that's the industrial standard and upload it in Fusion 360, where you can draw an ugly shape and extrude it away and edit it however you want. It's so simple. So I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope I could help you. So make sure to like, share and subscribe. I make all sorts of 3D printing and CAD stuff. I'm also working on a working exoskeleton so stay tuned, bye!